You've likely seen the big wind farms. Massive turbines generate power when the wind blows. But what happens when it dies down? There's a similar challenge with solar. On a cloudy day, how much energy can panels produce? Now PGE has found a way to harness and store that energy in a first-of-its-kind facility. It's kind of the next generation of renewable energy in that it combines wind, solar, and battery storage in a single facility in a single location. Wind and solar produce energy, and massive batteries store it. That enables you to save some of that energy and use it for times when you don't have the sun shining or the wind blowing. This is going to be the first large-scale energy facility in the country that will combine these three resources. The Wheat Ridge Renewable Energy Facility is in Morrow County, not far from the Boardman Coal Plant, closed in October. You can see it in the distance in this photo. The 300-megawatt wind farm is already finished. The 50-megawatt solar and 30-megawatt battery facilities will be completed by the end of 2021. It's kind of the wave of the future. Portland General Electric is partnering with Next Era Energy Resources on the project. PGE says it will help it achieve its goal of net zero greenhouse gas emissions by 2040. But as we transition away from coal and gas as energy demands increase, PGE says customers will also have to do their part by reducing how much they use. You sign up for one of our programs and we will adjust your thermostat or your water heater in order to save energy in small increments that you're not even going to notice. But if we spread it over 900,000 customers, it can make a huge difference. PGE invested $155 million in the project, a cost to be covered by customers. They'll see about a 1% increase on their bills, but the power they're paying for will be a lot friendlier to the environment. In Portland, Keeley Chalmers, KGW News.